think your oil temperature is rising. Oh, no. Okay. So now your pressure is falling. Yeah, we're definitely going to have an engine crew. Oh, I think I smell, I smell some, some, some smoke. Some smoke? Well, can I cut it? Yeah, you do whatever procedure you got to okay. do. What else you got to do? Turn off my fuel selector, cut off my mixture, try to choke this fire out. Okay. Let's try to aim for 105 knots. There we go. Uh, yeah, it's gone. Okay, it's gone. Now we're going to treat this as an engine failure. Okay. So we're going to push for get best flight speed. There could be a road too, but uh, I don't think I'll make it. Uh, really? It looks like we're yeah, right on top we're of the road. We're right on top of the road. <laughs> I'm not going to restart because I had an, an engine fire. Okay. I'm going to declare a 1 to 1.5. And then we'll squawk, you know, 7700. Everything, master off. Once I'm 100 feet off below the road, I'll start to unmatch the doors. Make sure my seatbelt shirt on is on. Make sure your seatbelt shirt on is on. So there is a curb. Mm -hmm. that uh, might be I know. <laughs> What's your plan? No. I'm saying, do you still need to be holding best glide? If you're right above your, your point and you know that you're going to run out of a road, what are you going to do? I, I still have 1,000 feet, so I could do a 180 back okay. onto the runway. Okay. Or the runway. The back road. to the other side? The other side, yeah. Okay. Boom. There's a lot of cars there, though, no? Yeah, but I hope they're more. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you can recover.